Welcome back everybody, I'm Sir, and we're going to jump right back into Halcyon 6. We left off last episode, I tried to close this morning, and the game said, screw you, you, know, you can't do that, it's not that easy. So I guess that just means we're going to move on here and investigate this colony, which this could be a very long tiered uh, fight. Dispatch a science officer here to attempt to mine it. Well, that's that's not what we're doing, but that's okay. Let's send uh, the Absurdia out there and uh, go investigate this colony. Commander, our fleet in the Kuril space has experienced a strange occurrence and are asking for guidance. Well, that's fine. That's what I'm here for. One of the cadets serving in our fleet is convinced that the voice of a long-dead relative has told him that a valuable treasure lies awaiting for our fleet at a nearby location. Well, that doesn't sound like a trap of the slightest. Investigate the source of the psychic message. Put the crew in counseling. Use the psychic sensor to investigate the cadet. Well, that seems reasonable. Let's, let's investigate him. Seems like perfect. Go away. You're a trap. I click you and things happen. Using the Corzan psychic device, your science team is able to isolate the psychic signal that was reaching out to him, the distressed cadet. An ancient artifact originating from what must have been the same spacefaring race that built Halcyon 6 itself. Acknowledge. Gain ancient sensors. Oh. Okay. Hold on, let's go back. What's that notification again? <laughs> Hold on, what is this? You can now craft ancient sensory 4 in the foundry. Uh, sure, what is it? I don't even know what this thing is. Oh, plus 20 aim. Wow, that's pretty awesome. That's that's a lot of aim. However, I don't feel like we really miss. Uh, we have our status effects miss all the time, but we don't actually miss the shots. Hmm. Uh, that's cool though, I suppose. Whatever. Can we can we go check out this colony now? No? Here we are. Investigate the colony, an officer. Uh, it's gonna take four days to investigate the colony, huh? Sure enough, go for it, I guess. Let's, uh, Kim has a level up. That sounds like a great thing, actually. Let's go ahead and do that. We can get you a bridge shot, which is... All right, I suppose, commando training. Ship powers, guard ally. Guard an ally for the next three rounds. If was a ship will absorb all incoming damage. Wow, I really wish Lucy had that. Super, super amount. This will get you more tactical. You know what? Let's screw it. I don't care. That's just one tactical difference. That's awesome. God, I really wish Lucy had that. Stop. Stop doing that. Listen to me. Listen to me the first time I click you. Element of surprise. Backstab maneuver. Gets you some science. Meh. Adds critical to you, which is actually the nicest part of all that. Ship power, supercharged weapons. Meh. Ground power, kamikaze. Meh. I don't know about either one of those. How about you? Risk assessment, suicide run? Risk assessment gets me suicide run? Doesn't make any sense. Unless the risk assessment just says, hey, it's not risky. Suicide. Nothing risky about that at all. Alright, can we please... Uh, crap, no, I need to go back here. Go back here. She needs to do the other ones, though. Actually, she can probably just upgrade people again. Yeah, you're level 7. Let's do that. Let's get um, their damage up. Sure. Oh, gosh, she's so much better at it than you are. Why is she so much better at it than you? You're both level 7. She's a biologist. No, I don't care. Whatever. Congrats, you got the job. <laughs> you can now do it. I don't know what's going on in that base anymore. It's all madness in there. Look at that, she's already finished. Let's have her do something else. Bloodlust Seminar. Well, that sounds awesome. Too bad you're not high enough level for it. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like that they get to do these things. And they get to be better, but I still don't feel like they're that strong. At least they're not instantly dying, so I guess they are considerably stronger. Uh, no, I want to clear this. It's in my brain. I don't like it. All right. Your rate team manages to trap a cruel abomination along a larva embarkment. A certain psychic force from inside the abomination reaches out to your squad, begging for death. Well, I can comply. That's what I've come to do. Yes, let's heal you and deploy. And a better... Whoa, that's 80 damage right off the bat. Whoa, you have 14,000 health. 1400 health. That would be terrible. 
All right, maybe we should start with the late recovery. Get rid of those dots, that would be quite nice. Uh, see if we can blind them, that would be very nice as well. Much, much needed. You have a dot on you, so I don't really need to give you one. Let's get you uh, nano shields up. I want that damage resistance, because that was a lot of heat you just took. I don't want anybody else getting it either. Just got hit, but she's all right. Kind of. Let's see if we can fuse them. These two are taking a lot of um, things. This guy is not. And he's doing a lot of damage. He's doing a lot of damage to Jess, which is concerning. Let's see. Oh, this is going to be a tough fight. We might not be getting out of here. Not in one piece. No, I don't want you to do that to self, though. I want you to do it to your friend. Ah, they're still hitting her. They, they don't care. Okay, that, that worked. Can you heal your friend so she doesn't die? Good job. Now you need help. My god, everyone's getting beaten up. What do we do to help? A shrapnel grenade with bleed? I do like the sound of that. They are hitting freaking hard. I get this feeling I shouldn't be here. <laughs> Call me crazy. I don't think we're ready for this. These guys are super tough. If we can get this guy, these two dead though, I think we're going to be in an okay spot. We just have to really focus them hard. And until then, mm, this guy particularly is doing a lot of damage. He needs to go. Fix exposed and blinded. That's a really nice thing to have on everybody, especially if it actually hits them. Nice evade. Can we get this guy down? He really needs to die. If he would dot to death, that'd be kind of fantastic. I'm not gonna lie. Delayed recovery. Put that on yourself. Alright, let's I feel like we can kill him if we try hard enough. Oh, excellent. Having one person down is going to be a huge freaking help. I think we got this. We just got to hang tight. Wait till we can heal again, really, is, is kind of what it comes down to. Ugh, dodge and then hit. Uh, we could stun somebody. 75% chance to stun. That's actually not too bad. That hits for a lot of damage as well, though. As is that. What's our stun chance? Zero and 75. Interesting. Uh, is it worth a stun? I mean, this guy's turns kind of a while from now, so I'm thinking probably not. We can probably kill him first, is what I'm hoping for. Rabbit? That sounds bad. Sounds uh, really bad. I'm gonna keep this ready for when it's for when it's the right time. It's not the right time yet. Did you? Uh, let's see if we can get this guy. Uh, that would make me very happy. Exploits blinded. You are blinded. How much are we talking? Mm, not enough to kill you, even if we hit. Uh, you know what, let's do it anyways, in preparation for the next person who can hopefully attack you and kill you. Nice evading, guys. Wow, they both evaded. He healed, though, for a lot of freaking damage, which really upsets me. Let's, uh, let's stun him now. Screw you, man. Get out of here. Let's irradiate him. Well, I want him dead before it's his turn. I think we can totally do that. It's got 100 health left. Shrapnel grenade people. It's got a dot. It's got 8 health. Let's kill him. I don't care if he's got 8 health, he might dot. I was afraid he might heal first. I'm gonna blind him. Excellent. Let's get the last heal on you. Get shields up on people. See if we can 
His defense is down. He resisted. Unfortunate. We evaded again. Great job. I'm really glad he's blinded. That is doing a lot for us. Good. We slowed him down and we decreased his uh, damage that he does. Excellent. I'm very happy with that. Let's see if we can just put him down now. He's got a lot of health, but uh, if we can keep dodging his stuff, I think we're going to be alright. If you use him, we just line him up with as many status effects as we can. He is about to not be blind. Let's see if we can get that back on him. Yep, looks good. Looks like we got away with it. Hazard zone, all enemies. Nope, oh, let's just do this. We don't need an AoE. Let's just keep hitting him. He's got 200 health, we're almost there, come on. Keep landing him. And this might be it here. Four health, dead. Oh my god, I really didn't think we were gonna survive this fight. For a hot second, I was really regretting coming here. That is a crappy reward. For this fight. Terribly shitty. It was a pretty bit we managed to secure the divergent terminus flesh from the insides of the abomination. We're bringing it back to the lab for study. Well, that seems like a perfectly reasonable thing to do. Ground combat aim plus five. Good job, Elfine. Yeah, that fight sucked a lot. Uh, I'm really glad it's not a like chain of fights though, like some of them have been. Sure location. Let's see what else can we do. Well, the seminar sounds like a really good time. I'm not gonna lie. Bio overclocking increases the speed. I mean, that's a that's a decent speed. I'll give it to you. Let's do it. Let us do that. In there, biased biologist, whatever your job is. Commander, we received communication from Blah to send a fleet at once. They are the mm, Zlar. Zlar are known for their. Histronics, so take it with a grain of salt. Ugh. Let's see what are our missions now. Everybody wants something from us, I tell you. Where are you? Now are you going to try to trick me? I should just murder you while I can. Screw you guys. Screw all of you. I don't know why I even deal with you. This is all my space. Someday you will learn. I'm just going to turn extremely xenophobic after these attacks. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Okay, so do we have what it takes to pilot one of those? I'm guessing no. But I'm gonna entertain the idea nonetheless. So we have a commando. Somebody can go commando. It will be Lucy. Do you have requirements listed? What's needed to fly you? It says tier five. That's a lot of freaking damage. I mean, we can do it. We got plenty of people. You have no variable obstacles that can command the ship. I, you're not telling me what they need. Sorry. I mean, I feel like we might as well build it anyways, right? God, that ship is huge as well. When they're ready, we'll switch them over. We just got too many people in Dark Matter sitting around. There's nothing else to really do with it. Yeah, heck yeah, I get one of those, man. And then lastly, we got the Therm Tarash, the wizard. Which I thought were pretty much the same thing, but I guess I don't really know what a Therm Tarash is. I'm probably not even pronouncing it correctly, but that's how I pronounced it when I played a lot of Final Fantasy XIV, so good enough. I want the one that does more damage. I want more damage all the time. Yes. Thank you. And let's build one of these, because I no idea whatsoever what they would be good for. Not made for combat. Well, that's fine. Wasn't, wasn't planning on using it in combat, to be honest, so... Guess that works out. There is no tier 6 as far as I can tell. Excellent. Good stuff. Get back to the station with that thing. I want to look at it. Alright, what next? Base of training, probably. I think also level 10. Fair enough. So, uh, who can do it quickly? See, now you can do this one quicker than the other person could. I don't understand what's going on. This game does not make any sense to me. It makes me feel really dumb. 
pretty much all the time. But a lot of things do, so I guess that's not really that much of a surprise. Alright, Tumorous Cruel Fresh is ready for study. Well, I don't see why we shouldn't study it. Correct me if I'm wrong. Form Autopsy. Cries a level 10. Well, we got one of those. And uh, Elphine is promising to do it in five days. Sure, that will give us time to do other things, I suppose. How about you? Enhanced Advancement Practices. 60% from combat. I don't see why we wouldn't do that, to be honest. Go ahead, adjust. Seven days. Ooh. Okay. So goes, I guess. I guess that means we'll just have Lucy upgrade the next tier of ships, even though they don't have one yet. What are we what are we even building, to be honest? I don't remember what it was called. Shuttle, the Mirage Champion. Commando, that's right. Commando. Now the champion, the commando. So the commando has two options here. We can increase, go away. You're in the way. We can increase its speed and evasion by five, which really isn't that bad. Or we can increase its aim by 15 and damage by 10%. That's a lot of damage, actually. I mean, five speed and evasion is a lot too. Let's see if we can do this. I mean, we'll probably do both of them, let's be honest. We have a lot of dark matter. A lot of freaking dark matter. Well, that would take just a lot less time. Is it for just then? Uh, maybe I'm screwing up the ships. Probably. And yeah, that was one of them. What was the other one we were building? The champion. Okay, that's this one. Fair enough. Get plus 15 aim and 5 speed, or plus 10% haul and damage. Okay, let's try that one. This is engineering, this is Lucy's gig. All right. Great job. Like I said, we'll probably end up doing both of them. Triplication. What's next? Instinct drills. Increase the cadet's ground evasion to two. Just feels so low. Feels like it's not even worth it. But I guess when one of them doesn't die, I'll be real happy. As well as everybody else. Okay, well, that was very quick. Sensory upgrades. We don't have the materials for that. Okay, well, I suppose that's something. There we go. Now who doesn't have the materials? Well, it'll be me here again in a second, but... I like you, you have green skin. Uh, that doesn't mean anything. I guess that means I'm reverse racist. It's people that don't have green skin, like myself. Two five ships, all right. The commando class ship is now ready for duty. <laughs> you said duty. Uh, it says Jess can, can drive it. Phenomenal, well she will. I'll be showing you that. Complete its task, let's show location. Uh, did you say something about distress signal down here? Oh yes, somebody's under attack. Okay. That's fine, I suppose, whatever. Let's get the other champion one done. The extra 15 and 5, that's, that's pretty nice. Oh, and then there will be butts to kick for this. How much have we got on those other things? Three days there. And one day remaining on that. All right. So I thought I'd give you a heads up about about an interesting development that has taken place over here. You know, my flesh husks, well, the ones that pilot my ships, and do my every bidding. I think you have them, too, but call them officers. I think you have them, too, but you call them officers. I'll read this eventually. Some of the crew were able to possess a number of mine. How embarrassing is that? Did it occur to you maybe the crew gave them their freedom? That's some terrible news, sorry to hear it. Let me guess, those fleets are coming towards us, aren't they? Yep. Sorry about that. It's definitely not anything I decided to do. And certainly don't worry about the er eradicating them or anything. Plenty more where they came from. They make fine target buys. Don't mention it. Anyways, thanks for being so understanding. Yeah, well, these things happen. Those cruels are assholes, we know. We get it. So where are they at? 
Yeah, over here. Oh, hold on. What's up there? Commander, the divergent cruel flesh has yielded some astonishing discoveries. Rather than being mutated, the belly's flesh matter with integrated cruel biomass, it has become apparent that it is greater psychic responsiveness stems from the fact that there is a healthy cruel flesh. While the several Serville, server, Seville, cruel flesh, we're best acquainted with, is in truth diseased and rotting. Well, what a likely excuse! I'm going to kill them all, anyways. Our re engineering team has suggested that in studying the psychic distress signals emanating from the healthy cruel flesh, we may be able to jury rig a cruel communication device that may allow us to communicate to any psychically healthy cruel beings we encounter. Which is how many? How many healthy ones have we been encountering? Just one, as far as we know. Alright, we get a reward. That is uni. Uh, Alright, let's get the communicator. Maybe we can talk to him, I suppose. Whatever. Who cares? Just burn it. Just burn them all. It doesn't matter. It doesn't. Kill him. I mean, you can do it slightly faster. We'll have you do it, I suppose. We have things that are gonna coming up soon. But we got some time. New ship should be ready soon. This is a sensory upgrade. Did I tell you to do that? I don't feel like I did. Champion's gonna be ready soon. Three days. All right. We'll, have, we'll just have more ships for fighting purposes, which will be nice. Go away. Uh, complete another task. Do we have more tasks for them to complete then? This is one combat division of four. Well, that's nice, I suppose. And here they are, most likely to bombard and kill things. It completed its task. Nice bonus experience. So we'll have to have Jess ready. Complete its task. Uh, that's fine. Actually, no, it's not fine. Go back and we'll have people repeat crew, crew things and stuff. No, not you. 14 days and four. What is going on here? It's madness. All right, so this thing's gonna obviously cause some problems and probably bombard me for lots of health, which is annoying. Uh, 37 is a problem. That is quite a problem. It's a severe amount of damage we're taking. Anyways, this guy got a level, let's look at that. Uh, great. Plenty of extra engineering. Good for you. Experiment with thrusters. Uh, yeah, sure. How about you? Plus aim. Plus damage. Ugh, whatever. Sure, take that. I don't care. Get out of my sight. I got more important things to do. People are dying freaking everywhere, man. Three days remaining. One day remaining. I'm probably going to have to cancel you. LV, that's just, oh, it's taking so long. It's it's sad, but let's have somebody else do it if they can't. No, nobody else can do it. That's fine. Don't worry about it then. Let's, uh, at least he's done fooling around, tinkering with ships and stuff, uh, which is apparently now. And we're going to go out there and kill some things and stuff. It'll be a good time. Everyone's going to have a good time. It's going to be a good time. So we have a new ship, right? Where are you? It is the Commando. Let's so, can we make just we'll just throw just in there. Excellent. Let's uh where'd that old ship go? This one. We didn't have it very long, that's okay. Move on up, I say. Let's stick this other equipment on. Uh that's a lot of speed. Did you need speed? Kind of. Speed and I don't feel like you need to aim. Damage is always nice. I'll take the damage. Oh wait, you can equip three? Hell yeah, let's take that haul too then. Bam! And now what kind of powers do you have? Nope, that's the wrong button. Uh, all over the place. What you have here, trip shot, all enemies. Counter snipe, single enemy. Mm-hmm. 
Pulse Mesh, all enemies. Exploit sensors offline. Uh, I like that, I suppose. I don't feel like I like this entire setup though. I missed the other ones that worked better off of each other. Exploit sensor offline isn't as good, if you ask me. Exploit's vulnerable. What's the point of counter snipe then? Hmm. Ugh, I do like the previous setup better, but... Oh well, it's unfortunate, it's just what it is now, I guess. Either way, uh, let's murder these people. They... whoa! It's a big cube. I like it. So tier 4s and 1 tier 5? Well, look at that. We are just as ready as they are, then. Let's uh, kick her out. Goodbye. I feel like maybe I should bring that ship, just because it works better with these other tier 4s. <sighs> Alright, let's go fight him. Yeah, this will be the last thing we do this episode, but this has been an exciting episode, man. We've had a lot happen. Fortunately, we couldn't finish that study, but we just can't wait that long. They are doing way too much damage to our uh, Halcyon thingy. You know, the Halcyon thingy that we live in. You know the one. Got protective shields up, that will be a lot of damage, it will save us. And we'll try to pull as much aggro as we can. Strong work. Plus 130. Plus 130. Let's do you. I think you're going to be the main damage dealer over there. And you're already hurting pretty badly. So it's you, so we have a nice heal going. Your hall breach, that's okay. Let's brace. Barely take any damage over time. Alright, let's see. Can we. Weapon disruption. What do you have that goes well with weapon disruption? Or do we just want to panic the crew? Ah, uh, this goes well with weapon disruption, but it's just a level one. Yeah, but that's a lot of damage it's doing to things, actually. Alright, fair enough. It destroys him. I'm happy with it. Quite happy with it, actually. Let's get the vulnerable on people. It makes a big difference. Increases your resistance after I already did it to you. Oh, I see. They increase the resistance to whatever I just did to them. Tricky. Tricky little bastards. Don't think I haven't noticed what you're doing. It'll be too late. It's too late for you and your trickiness. Time you adapt, you're already dead, see? Split screw medic. It's disabled ship, perfect. Bam! 1300 damage. Go screw yourself, sir. Can I do you now? What are my options left? I'm blind you? Alright. Display vulnerable. Yeah, 2200 help. Suck on that. We are ready. We're ready to conquer the universe. Fair amount of supplies out of that. And everyone's in good shape. Excellent. Our base is still mostly together. One of those ships is leveled up. Can we do things to increase our ship or um Halcyon 6's health? Because I feel like that might not be a terrible idea. Uh, this is to repair things, which is all well and good. For a lot of freaking materials. Where is the is the foundry that increases its base health? I mean, not that it matters if the base health is increased, right? Because we're not even there yet. But yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying. What I'm saying is we still need to probably raise it. And increase the amount of daily healing it does, which is probably a good idea too. Hmm, okay. One time exercise to overwork the cadets for the sake of Halcyon 6 increases the station's maximum health. Only cost us 400 people. We got plenty of people. Screw it, man. Do it. Prepare drone overdrive. Well, that's really cool because it uses drones. I like that. It's, uh. Doesn't seem like a job for Jess. Yeah. 
Seems like a job for Kim, but she's busy. That's fine. Uh, green lady can do it. Alright, we'll end the end episode here. I've been having a lot of fun, and I hope you guys are too. If you want to see more content from me, don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to support me directly, please do leave a like on the video. It means a lot to me. I hope you guys are having a great time, and I'll see you in the next episode. Take care.